Hey everybody, it's Lisa from Shabby Road Studio. It looks like today is day 16. Hopefully I can get my dates right. I keep messing up. Well, there for a while I was trying to pre-record uh, a, a video ahead so in the morning I could just upload it. And today I am doing it on the actual 16th because uh, I didn't get a chance yesterday to film an extra um, day. So today is day 16 of Defemorember, and the prompt is packaging an index card booklet. So let's see if we can figure this one out. So I guess this is going to be my packaging. This is um, some from Amazon, obviously, and I like the color. But we're going to change that up a bit here, of course. I'm going to just start playing. I'm going to start playing with this first. And then we'll try to make a booklet out of it. I'm just going to throw some gesso on here. Um, randomly. And then a few other things. Just gesso. Gesso, gesso. I'm going to try to put a little bit of the same yellow that runs throughout my um, journal that I am going to be using for this project. So let's see. I'll pour some over here. Okay, so that's cool. If you get that um, heat gun too close, it starts to, you know, really make this hot and then it's giving it a kind of a crackly look, which I love. Okay, so I'm excited because I got a new Distress Oxide the other day. Yeah, I broke down. Um, I've been wanting this color for a while, Salvage Patina. I know everybody probably already has this and has had it for years, but I am just getting one, and I am super excited about it. Ah! Isn't that a gorgeous color? Okay. I don't know. I don't know if I want to do it with the brush or if I want to... Ugh. Isn't that a yummy color? I do love it so. Now you can see my uh, buffalo plaid. That means I'm working in my pajamas. <laughs> I tell on myself. Just no need to get dressed yet. I do some of my best work in my pajamas. Thank you very much. Okay, let's give that a break. Uh, let me put my top on my chalk paint. Okay, well, I'm thinking here is, hmm, I have my vintage photo. How do I want to apply this? That's not my good one. Let's see. There it is. Gather twigs. Uh -uh. This is a. Where can I go with a spray here? If I can get it to spray. There we go. All right. Let's add some water. Let's 
have a play with this and see what happens. Oh, the colors are mixing. Run. Take some of it back off now. Let's see where we're at. Okay, let me dry that. that oh shoot hmm. all right let's see maybe some rusty nail would work better a rusty hinge I mean I can sort of see it but not really Well, it'll be faint, but it'll be there. It'll, it'll give it another um, layer. Yeah. Doing it in the area so they're not painted as much. I mean, that's my whole goal was to just kind of add another faint layer. So, um, let's see. What would this be like? Yeah. Okay. I am in love with salvage patina. me happier there. Just to get a little interesting here. Right. I like it. Okay. fun. Since today is the 16th day of November. Remember. Okay. What else? Try 
trying to get my splattering technique better. It's clearly, I have a lot of work to do yet. little thing it just gives these little tracks and it just gives a subtle uh, little texture to it or another layer so I like that uh, now I was just thinking while I was drying this I probably should have done all this on this side because that's where the the uh, print is but no I did it on the plain side <laughs> oh well anyways all right Here's one of my coffee stains index cards. I'm trying to see how big, where do I want this? All right, I'm going to go so. Some of this and I'll be right back okay let's go so I took this over and I sewed around let's see sewed around it in various areas and then I decided to come over and actually cut a piece that I thought would fit for my uh, index card booklet so this is what I come up with so these will be used for something else, absolutely, in the future. And this is the little uh, cover using my packaging. Now I'm going to go ahead and uh, put something in here. That would probably work. Yep. I just did some book pages when I was doing my coffee dye paper yesterday just threw some book pages in there hopefully this doesn't say anything naughty uh, i suppose i should read that anyway i like the way the lines i put that in the um, oven and it created these crisscross lines which is kind of cool i think i'm gonna slap that right on there yep that's what i'm gonna do okay. Yeah, I know it doesn't cover the edges. thinking about using fabric. So that's what I'm going to do. I am going to go and sew these on. I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. So I went ahead and I sewed each index card to my um, muslin scrap fabric. And then I just laid them in here and sewed them into the middle. So it's got one, two, three, four little cards to journal on. So it can go like this or this, whatever. Um, 
Oh, let's make a pocket in here. Let's make a pocket in here with another piece. How about that? That'll look cool. Okay. All right, so it's a little long. Still a little long. I'm gonna go sew that on. So we got a little pocket. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I should have sewed across that first. Oh well. Let's give that a little. Let's give that a little glue down. Those two layers are opened up now. And I could have sewn across there first, but I didn't think of it. So glue to the rescue. Which was a little grungier out here. Yeah, that's better. Oh, yeah. Sometimes you just gotta use the big guns. So we have a little pocket with index cards. Ah, shoot, we didn't pick an animal. Dang it. I like it. Let's go with the snail. Oh! Oh, that's a bad word. Oh my goodness. Okay. So glad I found that. I guess I need to check these books better for naughty words. Oh, for this guy. And I love using book pages because they're just I don't know. I just love them. That's all. Dude. playing card in there. Now, is that all we want to do? Yeah, I think I like it. Let's try to find a better place for that 16, though. Yeah. Okay, how about right inside here? There we go. Day 16 of Defemerember. Fishy. Ah, look back 
look at all the things we've done. Crazy, right? It's been a fun month. I don't really like the colors of this. Ugh. I gotta stick something in that envelope. I thought when I, uh, you know, kind of dyed it up a little bit, it wouldn't be so purple. But it is. That guy's too thick for that. Just we already got something in there. Uh, let's see. Let's see. I mean, what would be the problem of sticking it in one of these envelopes? Right? No problem. That's where it'll go. All right, everybody. Thank you for putting up with me for 16 days so far. I appreciate each and every one of you that took the time to watch these videos. I will see you again tomorrow for day 17. Bye.